Hi, I'm Laura Marriott. I work for Wilhelm's Portland Memorial. I'm on the administrative team, and I like to consider myself a local historian here at Wilhelm's, and I'd love to share some of the beauty and architecture and some of the more unusual places that I like to visit when I come into the mausoleum. I'd love for you to join me. One of my first and most favorite places to visit while I'm at the mausoleum is the Wilson K window that you can see the entire mural from. We're blessed to have one of the largest hand-painted murals west of the Mississippi. And it's pretty neat in the fact that it's 50,000 square feet and it was hand-painted by Shane Bennett. Now the neat thing about it, and I, what really endears me to it, is that it was supposed to be his legacy, his big piece of artwork that he was known for. And she died in the middle of making it. But instead of letting it go unfinished, his father, who was also a painter, and some of his close friends and family finished the mural for him in a wonderful act of love. And so that's one of my favorite, favorite parts of the mausoleum is through this window, you can see not just the birds, but you can see the lower part of the mural that has the beavers and the ducks and things that you can't see from anywhere else. One of the next favorite spots in the mausoleum for me, of course, is in off the 14th Street exit. There's the original funeral director's offices, right in, a, in conjunction with the Azalea Room. What makes it special to me is the copper-faced fireplaces and some of the original wallpaper. It just looks like something out of a different era, and I love it. The last thing that I'll share with you today is something very, very special to me. The Povey brothers were stained glass artists that were the Tiffany's of the Northwest, if you will. They're very famous in the Portland and Northwest area. We have many examples of original Povey Brothers stained glass, but according to my research of what I've been able to find out there in the interwebs <laughs> is that the earliest signed piece that is known is in 1923. But I'll tell you what, here at Wilhelm's, we have a signed piece in 1919. Now that you've seen some of my favorite places in the mausoleum, I would love for you to come and choose some of your own favorite places. We offer free tours to the public Wednesdays and Fridays at 3 p.m. We always say come a few minutes early because the space is filled up quick. We'd love to share this piece of history, art, and love with you. Thank you. <laughs>